sea monster life. So he says here, I need a segment to teach people what farming is and its purpose in St. Lucia. So I'm going to see if I can bring this guy on. If, if I can, this is going to be awesome. Because one of the biggest um, guys in the sea moss injury is, industry is this guy named Nimrod. And he has, um, oh no, it's, this is some guy, Derek B. Anyways, I thought I got excited because I thought it was this guy I know in St. Lucia who knows a lot about sea moss. And you know what I mean? It was cool to have him on as a group to share his sort of because it's one thing to talk about, you know, this and that, but it's different when you're on the ground. Do you know what I mean? And a lot of these guys are on the ground and they see, because that's that was the main thing that made me want to come out and spread out the information and the truth. Was because when I was in St. Lucia, I would have guys come up to me and be like, so and so. Well, that guy is saying this about CMOS and that about CMOS, and he doesn't know about CMOS, and you, you go talk. I don't even know. Like they're acting like the, like I'm best friends with the guy when he's like some random guy in the states. You know what I mean? And so I realize that these guys are all watching us. Do you know what I mean? And they're seeing how we are. And you have to kind of what's the word I'm looking for? You can't you can't be put spewing out bullshit. You know what I mean? Or at least for me, because when I when they see me on the street on the island, they'll they'll pull me aside and be like, hey, because a lot of people know me down there. Have you ever heard about grass um, generally regarded, regarded as safe and GMPs, good manufacturing practices, good agricultural practices? I, I've heard of yeah, about those standards. Yeah. I, you, you, ever, you ever think about the possibility that one day they will regulate CMOS, the CMOS industry, like FDA will regulate it? You know what I mean? I think it's coming, but they do kind of like not regulate it, but you know what I mean? There are certain standards in the industrial place, in the industrial level. I mean, CMOS is going to make some 24 billion very soon, you know, by 20, say 2013. Mm -hmm. So, so FDA will put their hands into it and there's the other day they recognize the nutritional profile of CMOS, you know. Personally, I see it as an opportunity for individuals who set themselves up early, uh, who position themselves. That, because it. what people think with the FDA getting involved, the FDA is going to ban CMOS. No. They can't. No. It's not no. even possible to ban food. That what they will do not, is not use the level. information that we have and the data that we make available to help to regulate the market. Mm -hmm. But if we don't get a proper grip on it from grounds up. They will monetize this thing from top down. 